check the mic and make sure it sound right. I'm sure many of us uh, in Dinarland are parts of uh, newsletters or groups and things of that nature. I've been a part of this one for a um, good while. It's a source of information that I use. Um, and the purpose of this video is not only to share information, but to do just a brief um, example and illustration of how we can get this information from what we call gurus, um, but we can also so easily attempt to verify what we see. And so I'm going to begin with Holly and Judy uh, Thursday morning RV updates. And on the Holly and Judy Thursday morning updates, there's a lot of information, but for the purposes of this video, I'm going to show this portion here where it says, Russia cuts U.S. dollar completely from sovereign wealth fund. Breaking news, the Reserve Bank of New Zealand will explore the potential for a central bank. Breaking news, the Bank of Jamaica will roll out its central bank digital currency pilot next month. Now we can take this information in and believe it at face value, or we can do just a couple of steps and see if there's any um, truth or accuracy to it. And as far as Russia cuts dollar completely from the sovereign wealth fund, it didn't take a whole lot to find this article here. And this article here from RT says, dated July 7th, Russia's sovereign wealth fund cuts U.S. dollar zero reserves to zero. Uh, that's a confirmation if you trust RT as a source, and it says here Russia has eliminated U.S. currency from its national wealth fund while boosting the share of the euro, the Chinese yuan, and gold. We're going to a gold-backed uh, system, folks. And so there one is verified. There was another one here. The Reserve Bank of New Zealand will explore the potential for a central bank digital currency. Well, on Yahoo News. The Reserve Bank of New Zealand to consult on potential CBDC, dated yesterday again. And here it says that they will explore the potential for a central bank digital currency as part of a series of consultations to be carried out by the end of the year. And there's much more to read there, but I'm just trying to show examples of how we can confirm what we read. The next one. Breaking news, the Bank of Jamo Jamaica will roll out its central bank digital currency pilot next month. Well, this article, the Bank of Jamaica plans CBDC pilot for August. That is next month. And it will begin piloting the CBDC in August. The pilot will be rolled out across financial institutions. The first step will be commencing the pilot with the National Commercial Bank. Also, this article here from the Bank of Jamaica. Bank of Jamaica prepares for central bank digital currency. After quietly exploring the viability of a central bank digital currency for some time, Bank of Jamaica took the decision in May 2020 as part of an ongoing retail payments reform, keep that in mind from prior videos, to venture into this digital innova innovation that is fast becoming a feature of global central banks. So another confirmation. And a little bit lower. We see a safe link website will be published on various Dinar websites plus sent out by email. For all Tier 4B currency, ZIM holders worldwide for appointments at redemption centers in their particular country. It didn't take a whole lot, folks, to go here to government benefits and to see that SafeLink Wireless most certainly is in relationships with the United States government, who is overseeing this RV for sure in this country that I live in, the United States of America. 
and SafeLink Wireless is the largest and oldest provider of free government phones in existence today. So is there some credibility to the information that we receive from our recaps and then this one specifically from Holly and Judy Thursday morning RV updates? The answer is most undoubtedly yes. And that's how we can do a little bit of research on ourselves to find out the veracity of what we come across and learn. We do not have to depend on gurus, and I assure you, I am not a guru. But I am invested in the Iraqi dinar, and I am invested in the Vietnamese dong, and I am invested in the Zim. I am invested in cryptocurrencies, and I am invested in precious metals. And I thought this brief video would be a way of reassuring folks who come to DK will talk about it that I do my research and this is just a brief showing I assure you when I do my research I seek and hopefully find the truth thanks for stopping by make sure you like and subscribe and I hope to see you back and I would just like to say if you take the time to watch the videos it will be much appreciated to do such a simple effort as to hit the like button and to subscribe and hopefully hit the bell for notifications to know when I put out another video. It is greatly appreciated for the work put into these videos and it helps keep this going. It helps get me boosted up to get this thing rolling. Um, I appreciate your help. You have a nice day. Thanks for stopping by. To DK, we'll talk about it.